Welcome to our podcast, where we cover unique and interesting stories for you. In this episode, we will discuss how Earth's lakes are rapidly losing oxygen. Study reveals. New research has uncovered a significant drop in oxygen levels across Earth's lakes, with some losing oxygen up to nine times faster than oceans. Between 1980 and 2017, global lake oxygen levels declined by 5.5% in surface waters and 18.6% in deep waters, according to a study published in Science Advances. Researchers from the Chinese Academy of Sciences, led by geographer Yibo Zhang, analyzed satellite imagery and climate data to understand the causes behind these losses. Their study found that from 2003 to 2023, 85% of the 15,535 lakes examined experienced an increase in heat wave days per year. These heat waves contributed to 7.7% of the oxygen depletion by reducing water's ability to retain oxygen. However, the most significant factor remains rising global temperatures, which account for up to 55% of the oxygen loss. If this warming trend continues, Lakes worldwide could experience an additional 9% decline in oxygen by the end of the century. Beyond temperature increases, the researchers attributed 10% of the oxygen decline to more frequent and severe algal blooms. These blooms, fueled by excess nutrients from fertilizer runoff and livestock waste, consume large amounts of oxygen, further depleting lake ecosystems. Oxygen depletion is creating dead zones in lakes, making them uninhabitable for aquatic life. Mass die-offs of fish and other species have already been observed worldwide, including eels in New Zealand, Murray cod in Australia, and fish and mussels in Poland and Germany. Lakes are also facing increased evaporation due to a warming atmosphere, accelerating shifts between drought and flooding. These disruptions threaten ecosystems and local economies, with severe implications for food security. The destruction of Earth's fourth largest lake serves as a stark warning of the consequences, potential solutions. According to Cass ecologist Shi Kun, planting submerged vegetation and constructing wetlands could also play a role in restoring lake ecosystems. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments. Stay connected for more exciting discussions and updates in our next podcast.